My name is Megan Gallagher. I'm a recent graduate of Slippery Rock University with a bachelor's in music education. My major instrument was clarinet, but I also did a lot of piano and singing, which I employed while I was a music director at a local church in Grove City for two years, where I also learned to play the organ, which was a lot of fun. Um, I love working with kids and I love teaching music, and so that's why I became a music teacher. Why I would like to teach in the Titusville School District is because my first student teaching placement was at Slippery Rock School District and I loved it there. It was so much of a community feel and I just felt so comfortable and I was told that Titusville is pretty much exactly like it and I got that from looking at your website about the community and about the school district. One thing I also noticed about your school district was that you really work towards getting your students to be lifelong learners and I believe myself to be a lifelong learner as well. I love going to professional development conferences and trying to see how I can improve myself to be a better teacher. As I had said in the last question, I believe myself to be a lifelong learner and this is a value that I want to instill in my own students that even if they don't continue in their musical studies once they leave school, they can continue learning and following whatever they are interested in. I've been to several conferences because I love teaching music and I want to improve myself. I don't think learning stops just when I get to my degree. I also believe that I would be a good teacher because I have a broad range of musical experiences. Even though I chose to focus in on band, I have been heavily involved in the choirs and would be just as happy teaching in a choir placement as I would in a band placement. And I've done a lot of general music too. Um, in Slippery Rock Area School District, I got to teach a ukulele class, which was something new for me and was a lot of fun to teach. I also enjoy working with a broad range of students. Uh, middle school does happen to be my favorite, but I find that I am successful when I'm working with all of the ages. I haven't had an issue with any of them. And finally, I like to collaborate with other teachers, especially those that aren't in the musical discipline, because I think sometimes I'm able to reach students in music better when I approach it from an angle of something that they're interested in. What my entry plan would be is to create a syllabus that outlines our short and long-term goals for the school year, which I would share with the students so that they're a part of the classroom. I would also introduce my students using either a video or PowerPoint so they get to know me not only as a teacher but as a person because as a music teacher you do spend a lot of time with your students and I think it's important that they get to know who you are. I would also have the students fill out a getting to know you worksheet, which I had used with my sixth grade general class and I found this really helped me get to know not only their names very quickly but also who they are as students and I was able to connect with them very well. Finally, I would use what I had learned in my field experience at New Mexico where I was observing the state teacher of the year. She used games to establish her classroom environment which I thought was really cool because not only were they interacting with each other but they were talking about why it was important to do these games so that they could learn how to interact with each other during the school year and while they were learning. My colleagues would say that I'm very organized and that I'm very goal-driven. They would also say that I'm very kind. That was always something that came up when they talked about how I interacted with students was that I'm very kind and very patient with them. They would also say that I'm knowledgeable in a lot of areas and they've seen me be successful in band, in choir, in general music. The students would say that I'm nice and that I'm fun and the comment that I got the most was that I was very caring. What really motivates me is seeing students have that light bulb moment and the joy on their face when they finally get something that they've been working hard to try to understand. I also enjoy it for me as a teacher personally because it's a challenge, like a puzzle, trying to figure out what I need to do to help them get there. I'm also motivated by new experiences. As I had said, I had traveled to New Mexico and I had gone to several conferences outside of the state because I think new experiences allow opportunities for growth and for learning. Finally, I was recently engaged in February, and as we're trying to put our lives together, I'm really motivated to pursue any opportunities that would allow us to be successful as we get started.